Good morning, morning from Puerto Plata. Mm -hmm. Now, technically, we have never been to this port before. We've been to Amber Cove mm -hmm. several times, and we've done things like Ocean World and island tours with Iguana Mama and all sorts of stuff in yeah. the Dominican Republic that has been fun. Mm -hmm. But since this is a new port, I think, we'll have to check, but I'm pretty sure we're at the Taino Bay complex, which is, so. <laughs> I know, which is really relatively new. We're just going to check that out today. They should have a pool, restaurants, shopping. Yep, and they're just in stuff. phase one right now, mm. so we want to obviously check it out today and then come back at some point and see how they've changed it. But it's supposed to be really nice and you can make a good, fun, frugal day out of it yeah. if you want to without going anywhere. So that's the plan yep. for today. But first, <laughs> breakfast. Yep. So let's roll up and eat some food. Let's do it. <laughs> Deck one midship is our eventual destination for today. But first, Dick Dan. Oh, and I was hoping for a dramatic, there it is. <laughs> Pretty quiet on the pool deck. Doesn't feel quite as humid out here as most days, even though we are fogging up a little bit. <laughs> Gluten-free, English breakfast, American breakfast as usual. Is Dee's plate? Yeah, her hardest challenge today was keeping the hard boiled <laughs> eggs from rolling all over the plate. Cereal, coffee. I got, well, a lot of fruit, some vegetables. I did get the English bangers as well as the American chicken sausage. A little hash brown, a little corned beef, and some cereal and coffee. <laughs> now down to deck one. The gangways are creaking and we are here. <laughs> Let's see, they've got some little buggies you can get to ride to the port. Oh well, we're pretty we're pretty good hoofing it, I'm sure. But <laughs> need to get those steps in. So we're rounding the square corner of the ship, getting our first glimpses. I see signs that say Taino, so we are in the place we thought we were. So Taino, or I guess maybe Taino, might be the more correct pronunciation. I'll just continue to probably say both. And people can be like, ah, you were wrong half the time. <laughs> Taino Bay. Better than being wrong the entire time. That's true. So this looks like an area you could purchase some tours. Oh, you've also got to watch out over the drop-off spot for the little, I want to call them tuk-tuks, the little cab. Fresh coconut, Monkey Island, what is going on? Oh, giant Diamonds International as soon as we come in the side. Fresh coconuts. <laughs> There's a fountain. There's restrooms over there. Okay. Oh, let's see maybe a map over here. Oh, let's, let's read all the signage since we're just learning about this place. There's the duty-free shop. You are here. Okay, so you've got the pier, the restrooms and the shopping and tours. Taino Village Shopping, Monkey Island. Gosh, okay, there's a lot of stuff here apparently. Oh. Good gracious, what can we learn? Okay, we are here in the shopping mall access. All right, let's just take a quick look around everything. So shopping mall access and the taxi zone and everything is through the duty free as usual. Got all our standard liquors. We got tunes jamming, sunglasses, last chance liquor. And now out into the world. Well, I see a bird already. There's numerous spots on the maps that are marked aviary. There's so three. There's a few friends over here. Hola, buenos dias. Hola. <laughs> oh, yeah, the sword is settled. Hola! Kind of sound like you're I think we're hearing things. <laughs> hola. Um, okay, I definitely heard hola that time. I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> I said hola. Tie dye store. Yeah, so it looks like there's a ton of shopping in here. About six or eight bars, and then at the far end of the complex is the pool. So we're just gonna have to walk by and explore everything. This is really nice. And then we'll find a pool. Yeah, they had been working on this for a while. I put a hat on my head. Ooh. There's more birds. Hola. Hola. Oh, that one's dancing. Oh, oh, it's though they do. This is the kind that I was holding. Is In Tennessee. <laughs> Ooh, hola. Quieres bailar? Muy bien. Wow. Eso. All right, let's see if I can remember. So you say to him, baila conmigo. Baila conmigo. Yeah. It's working. You're so cute. Oh my gosh. That, I've held this kind of bird before and they're the most active. Yay! Yes, I'm talking about you. Wow. 
Nope, you can't feed the birds, touch the birds. Oh gosh, don't flash the birds, uh, that's for sure. There's one of the bars over there. I'm seeing jewelry stores. I wanna see more birds, and they got monkeys up here, which, you know, I'm sure you have to pay to see the monkeys because they were selling tickets at the front gate. Oh, here's another one of these kind of birds. Oh, there's three. Yeah, are you guys feeling dancey this morning or no? No. No. Okay. No quieres bailar? Buenos dias. All right. Oh, we got distracted by a side view. Okay, there's some lounge chairs, and you can stare at that square ship booty. Well, that's cool. So loads and loads of loungers. Now, nobody's out here. There's no beach access from what we can tell, even though I saw the word beach on the sign in relation to a bar. But you got all these chairs. There's the pier. It is quite on the hike down the pier. And you can look out to all these various vessels. Oh, here's another little bar surrounded by water features. Oh, they have hanging chairs and stuff over there. All right, let's go investigate. Let's go this way. Peeking at some of the shops. Oh, they have a chocolate shop. Cacaito. Ooh, well, this is a party zone right here. Oh, hey. All right, here's where they keep their Ds. Oh man, they got music jamming in there. I don't know how much audio I can use. Um, okay, wait, I gotta, this is a giant. Holy King Kong. Oh, all right. Well, it looks like he's made up of pieces of old, you know, vehicles or something. Oh, he's kind of backlit and hard to see. Massive though. <laughs> that is a chunky monkey back there. <laughs> I think it's a gorilla. Oh, what rhymes with gorilla? That is a- Manila. Manila gorilla. <laughs> no. Vanilla. That is one vanilla gorilla. <laughs> oh yeah, mojito bar, all kinds of clothing, sunglasses. Maybe a little early for a mojito. <laughs> that's right, that's right. <laughs> Thank you. I like his theory. He said it's four o'clock somewhere. I'm like, hey, they get started an hour before we do. Yeah. Oh, we got a rum bar, a fish spa. Ho, ho, ho. Oh, I see the exit and the taxi zone and the downtown signs up here. Yeah, looking over there's a zone we missed. That might actually be the pool. So if we had chosen the left path back there. Yes, we have made it all the way through. Well, there is a little thing back there that shows maybe there are monkeys that you, yeah, right by the giant. Okay, so you would pay and you would go through the monkey exhibit. Anyway, we have made it to the far end. Boom! Let's check out this pool. Oh, here's some advertisements about phase two coming soon 2022 so they're planning on having that done i mean this wow. is currently september of 2022 huh. okay maybe it's something back behind the yeah wall. they're working hard awesome it's beautiful oh man they got tunes down here too so i'll keep talking over them but look we got loungers in the water we got beds all of this should be free to use we'll come read the rules i like the look of this Little showers over here to the side before you get in. All right, what are these rules? Use swimsuit. Okay, I like that that's the first rule. No naked bits, no lifeguard, no running, no diving, adult supervision, and four feet. Nice, four feet's good. Let's get in this bad boy, I like this. They have a swim up bar. You're speaking my language now. Have like beans or are you just supposed to sit somewhere else? Um, oh, first come, first come. Yeah, yeah, there's some loungers over there. I'm gonna say let's put our stuff in one and we'll see if anybody says anything. That's the only way to learn is by making mistakes. All right, we got the menu here. So we got cocktails, margaritas, beers, and rum. Whoa, backside shows all of your spirits and whatnot. Very nice, and sodas and Gatorades. All right, how's your water temp? Doing well? Thanks. Ah, okay. Well, we went ahead and decided to grab a couple of drinks. I mean, $8 margaritas. We'll see what size and quality they are. Yeah, this is, I'm getting very much uh, Costa Maya vibes. If you've ever been to Costa Maya, big shopping area, big pool at the port, restaurants and bars. Yeah, very Costa Maya. And you have to go all the way to the end to find the taxis, but they're easier to find here than in Costa Maya. Oh, hey. Margarita's incoming. Yeah. Oh, yes. Boom, so passion fruit, and then what they call lemon, which a lot of times lemon is lime. I've learned the word limon, limon. basically could mean a lemon or a lime in a lot of cultures. And so. they're in plastic, so you can take them yeah. in the pool. There you go. Very pretty. Very thoughtful. 
pretty short brown. <laughs> Passion fruits, yummy. Mm. <laughs> Funny, we've got competing music right now. We have Latin music coming from this side, and I took a pill in Ibiza on this side. Oh yes, now we're living that life. So they do have a ladder here. It was a little shaky, so I actually didn't use the ladder, but there are some stairs over here that we missed on our first investigation. Oh, we got ledges for Dee to hang out on. Always a plus. Oh yeah, they sneak up on you. Okay. They kind of blend in, yeah. There we go. So that's a, a good option to have rather than just a ladder. I like that. Eight steps. Eight steps. So, yeah, yeah. You just have to be a little careful coming up and down. And then over here we've got like a ledge that jumps up into a giant shallow sitting area, which is where the pool bar is as well. That's the swim up, well, you can't really call it a swim up, I guess. The sit bar <laughs> in the water. Yeah, it's the climb up and walk to the bar bar. Lots of loungers in the water. I think you can step down right there too, if you're not in the pool yet. Time for a Taino Bay spin. I almost called it Taino Beach, that's in Freeport. Taino <laughs> Bay. And then there, that's where they keep their D's, right here on the ledge, as to be expected. Hello. Yeah, from what we can tell, this is a freshwater pool. We usually tell by how we are able to float. We float really well in saltwater pools. I mean, I float okay. Yeah, you just have to try a little harder in a freshwater pool. Of course, it's only four feet deep all the way around, I believe, so. Just stand. We're exploring now to try to see if we can find any sort of shade. They've got palm trees and whatnot around, so you can probably find a little bit. Not bad. Y'all, we found shade and a ledge for D to sit. All right, we're living the life now. If you need us, we are going to be right here. Listening to simultaneous. My left ear has one and my right ear has the other. It's, a, it's amazing. Just like this palm tree is amazing. Or coconut palm. I'm just going to call it palm. Oh yeah, now the American one. Well, American, whatever it is. Just kidding. It's back. Oh, it actually sounds Latin on both sides now. There we go. And now some random pool basking because you can't have too much gorgeous pool footage with music in the background and stuff. Oh. Are you trying to learn the song already? I don't know. I've, I've recognized a few songs, a couple from each side actually, but we're learning them as we go, so yeah. We're learning new music. <laughs> Gosh, you've changed. You've been dipping and diving. You took your rash guard off. It's, it's hot. The sun. Oh gosh, there's the music again. The sun is <laughs> coming up in the break. sky. Yeah. I was waiting for quiet time, but that's not going to happen. Yeah, people are starting to come out now that the sun's getting a little higher in the sky. Nice. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Looks like I'm bopping you in the face when I dance like this, but that's, that's rude. Don't do that. All right. Well, at least one of the bars has looped. We've reached it. I think they have a two-hour loop of music because I, I just heard took a pill in Ibiza yeah. again, and that was what was on kind of when we got here. So it's time to wind it down. Yeah, we've been here for a good two hours, and I'm gonna say it's time to wander. We'll check out the rest of this port, and yep. then get back on the ship and yeah, have do some, some lunch and things. stuff. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's roll. Bye. All right, updates as to things we are learning. These boards are 9,000 degrees Kelvin. They're very warm, so run, run very quickly across them. But they have free Wi-Fi yeah. all around. We didn't bring our phones because I wasn't sure, but free Wi-Fi, I guess, sponsored by the port. That's a huge plus. And then the kids, it is. Too, we've seen a lot of them out. That's true. Really nice. They're enjoying their day. And I think that's cool. But we are going to dry up for a little bit here underneath our cabana, whatever you call this, day bed, and then we will wander some more. Right, we are done with the pool. Let's see, did we miss anything? That is the exit to the left and the rum rum bar. Yeah, I think if you keep going this way, you leave the complex for now. Oh, okay. So, yeah, walk the town that way. yeah, so we came in on that side. Let's go back on this side. We can make one full loop of the port. A cigar shop, wet floor sign shaped like bananas, which is amazing. Coral store. Cool, cute little truck. Casa Palapa flavors from Mexico. I see some restrooms up ahead there to the right. Taino Bay logo shop. Oh, logo gear. Dominican Yucaye Bay. Oh, gift store and art craft. 
We've also seen lots of little chairs like this kind of scattered along the walkway. They seem to be first come, first serve. We did find out that the day beds and everything at the pool, first come, first serve, no cost. Here we go, the little bar with the swinging seats and stuff, which is called the Sacred Bar. So this should meet us back up. This is the path we already walked, but hey, maybe we'll see some new stuff, <gasps> like a coffee shop. There's Dominican things. I'm more into Dominican stuff myself, but that's just a personal preference. Where are your birds? Oh, there's some over in the in the distance. Too. Was this not where one of our friends uh, was he earlier? Was there. Yeah, he was. Well, I guess it's not like they're stuck here. I guess they can fly from perch to perch. There's some little green friends over there. Generally, their wings are clipped. Oh, uh, true. So they can't fly away. This is a far inferior wet floor sign. Come on now. I'm disappointed. <laughs> what the banana was? Here's some of your dancing friends. Yeah. Want you to dance? Nope. You want to dance. Oh, he's not in the mood to dance right now. You want to dance? Oh, you're very curious. Oh, you kind of look like hey, you're like a yeah, vulture. You look like you're about to lunge. <laughs> Please don't lunge. Hola. Are you guacamaya? Are you gua Oh, well, you made pooped a little bit there, but that's, that's okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm not sure because we learned guacamaya roja, which kind of looks like that guy over there. You're all very colorful. I have a feeling Beautiful. you're the same kind. <laughs> Yeah. Are you talking about him? Como te llamas? Guagamaya Roja? Si. <laughs> we'll just okay. say you are, even if you're not. He's just like staring. <laughs> you, friend, are the talkative one over there. Yep, that's you. So there's some of that beach access, Diamonds International again, duty free, and of course your hola friends from earlier. Free Wi Fi, that's right. All right, I guess we are going. Well, bam. <laughs> it says duty. <laughs> there are the little rides. <laughs> Looks like the security gate is up here. We'll click on through. Right, we made it through security. Yeah, we'll get another little look at the beach area. All the way down to the Pu'el. Alrighty. Well, it was a day on relaxing day. Yeah, that was nice. <laughs> So I guess that's looking out to where some of the phase two construction is going to happen. And then all the way out to the end, there looks like some kind of a fort. I haven't done much research as to what that might be. There it is. Some kind of structure over there. Vroom, vroom. All right, let's check out the face towel and water situation. Whoop. Watch your step, mind your head. All right, we are all changed for our evening. We are going to try to make music trivia, which is happening in about one minute in the Constellation Lounge on 11. <laughs> oh, we made welcome, it. Welcome, everybody. All right, we are done with trivia. It is looking a little rocky and windy and cloudy out here. Um, yeah, we're bibbling a little bit. Oh, wow, people are like surfing back and forth in the wave pool. Wow. That's amazing. They know they're doing that? Yeah, they're, uh, I mean, they say that's one way to kind of avoid being seasick a little bit is to get in a body of water like that and just they're go with it. It's not that bad, it's standing here. No. All right, let's, uh, we're going to go try to find some snacks because yeah. we totally skipped lunch and it's almost dinner time, sadly. So let's go get a snack. I think some pizza will suit nicely. Yeah, it's about 4.30 now, so I think they're starting to think about setting up for dinner. 4.30 is a perfect lunch time, I would say. It's no lines, no waiting. Hello, Pizzeria. Oh yeah, I think they have to come out with their tongs and get it. So we have Hawaiian vegetable cheese and pepperoni. Hawaiian? Oh, we'll just snag a little table here by the window, directly over the um thing with the floor. Pizza, pizza, pizza. Well, and we both uh, moved our chairs so that we're not <laughs> actually sitting on, you know, you're not gonna go anywhere theoretically, but. So our next event after this is our nightly cocktail hour in the Rendezvous Lounge. So bread, yeah. bread time. Trivia update, totally forgot to do it. We did not win the music trivia. It was a Motown music trivia. I think we got 12 and the winner got 14 out of 15. General knowledge, we went into like a, I want to say a five-way tie for the high score through three grueling rounds of tiebreakers, came out victorious. Welcome to Rendezvous. That pizza hit the spot, I'm telling you. Now we're going to hit our favorite spot. 
So Carousel is getting ready to play a set in here this evening. They have not closed the windows down yet, so it is still nice and bright. <laughs> Time for some smooth tunes. Shades are going down, the first phases of darkness are coming upon us. Now they brought around the little candle lights. I guess they're getting ready to close the windows and make us go night night. It does get really dark. It does. Oh, they're closing the curtains now. All right, y'all, it's officially nap time. Mm. Smooth jazz, closed curtains, perfect recipe for a nap. Ooh. It is downright cozy in here, I'm telling you. Wow. All right, time to join the fray at the trellis. Ah, look at all those views. Let's look down the cocktail page, which, like I said, I'm pretty sure is the same every single day. There's the good stuff. Ooh, I see a few things striking my fancy tonight. There is our bread basket, complete with focaccia and Parmesan breadsticks. And we have, this was urban onion, butter, and hummus. dessert menu that is all of the beverages oh it is baked alaska night they've got a poached hair cherry brandy ice cream raspberry sorbet mandarin frozen yogurt all right Now we go to 11. Hello. Welcome back to Constellation. Oh, there was a game in here earlier, but we're coming in for Broadway music trivia. I think Majority Rules was earlier. Ooh, I think Majority Rules is still going on, actually. We've been to a couple of game shows like this before. I think to ask the audience a question, and each team has to provide an answer, and whoever has the popular answer, even if it's not the right answer, they get the point. Anyway, like I said, we're here for Broadway trivia and a little bit of dance dance later on. Okay, this is ending now. Well, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to do a Broadway musical show music. What you need to do, you need a paper and pencil. Okay, we do have papers and pencil right here. Uh, you can play up to six guests per team, no more than six guests. Am I clear with that? Okay. Now what we're we looking for? We're looking for the show name. We don't need the song name. Am I clear with that? Just the yes. show. Okay. We need the show name because this is the Broadway trivia, okay? Holy moly. We busted into silent disco up here now in the constellation. I'm not sure this this insane light pattern is making us a little bit crazy up here, but don't stop believing, y'all. They got three DJs up there. They do have a red, a green, and a blue. I think we are going to bail on this disco. So anyway, it's fun. We didn't even get the headphones, but <laughs> Ooh, we are going to head in a downwardly direction. We have come back to the cabin to find our paper for tomorrow and our paper for disembarkation the next day and some luggage tags and guys, it's dark chocolate night again. Good. Yeah, we are back in the cabin and we are going to bed. Yes. 
we decided not to hang around for silent disco. It's fun, and I like the fact that they were doing all three DJs yeah. live mixing on all three channels. But something with all those flashing lights in there and all that mess, we were just like, uh. -uh. Ship, it was messing with my head a little bit, but um, we're gonna it's, get some work done anyway, so that's okay. Yeah, it's fun. Go do it. Yes, absolutely. But any other words? What the heck? I don't even know what we've done. We, we had a great food. day in we Puerto did. Plata at Taino Bay. Yeah, Taino, Taino Bay, yeah. however you want to say it. Um, really nice port, beautiful, immaculately clean. Mm. Keep in mind, it is about almost three years old, but it's a little strange because yeah. it had to shut down before it like officially opened. So the pool area, there's some boards and things like that that look like they need replacing, but it's still fairly new. True. It's a beautiful it's port, though. recently opened, Correct. but they started building it before the pandemic, I believe is the history. I'll have yeah. to Google that somewhere. Exactly. Um, and then we just had a really fun night. We met some new friends on the ship, so yep, it's been fun hanging months. out with them. Yeah. Um, and that's it. We just sat there and chatted at the mm -hmm. silent disco, and then we were like, bye. <laughs> so... That's it. Tomorrow is a sea day. I'm hearing. I feel like they're playing basketball. There's above banging it. noises. It's thick four. That the cabin be. above us. <laughs> Actually, the theater is above us. The entrance to the uh, theater. They have a comedy show. Late night comedy. People show. are stomping up there anyway. <laughs> anyway. Uh, but yeah, we're going to bed. We'll yep. see you at sea day tomorrow. That's Lots it. of fun to come. That's our last day. So. Oh, don't talk about that. Good night. Really sad. <laughs> Bye. Good night. <laughs>